In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use Blender's node groups. Here are the full nodes that we'll be using as an example. Let's create a node group for Voronoi, Noise, and Color Ramp. This is how we normally change the node values. We can do the same while we're using node groups. To create a node group, we must group select the nodes first. Press Ctrl G to group them. Now we're in the node group window. Press Tab to exit the node group window. The previously complex nodes have become a node group. Go access the group, either click the icon at the top right corner of the node, or press Tab. To access the node settings from this node group node, we must connect them to the group input node like this. The Voronoi node scale setting was transferred to the group input node, and now we can access it from the outside. We can change the setting values directly from the external node group like this. I'll show you how to connect multiple nodes into the group input node. Let's transfer noise node scale into group input. There's an option to rename, but that will only change the original node name. The group input nodes can be confusing if they contain the same name entries in the same node. This is how node group works in Blender. Also, we can't group input connect the nodes that are already connected to something else. To ungroup a node group, we can right-click the node group to ungroup, or press Ctrl, Alt, and G together. Ctrl, G to group the selected nodes. This is the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching.